G'day guys, Greg here. Now it's meat pie review time and today I'm off to a place called Little Kiwi Bakehouse at Narang. One of my subscribers said I should go there so I'll whip in today and suss it out and see what one of their pies is like. And well, it's got a 4.8 Google star rating so I'm expecting quite a lot. Let's go. Alright, here we go, the Little Kiwi Bakehouse meat pie. I've got a mince pie today, $7. Uh, most of the pies are around sort of $8, $8.50 if you wanted a steak and cheese or something. I thought I'd just go a classic mince to see what it's like. Anyway, this one costs $7. Now, I've got some scales here. Let's see how much this weighs. All right, so you're looking at about the 250-odd gram mark. All right, well, that's heavier than a frozen meat pie, but it's a little bit lighter than most other pie shop pies. Anyway, let's suss it out and see what it looks like. <laughs> Did I mention that that pie shop was packed? I mean, there's people lining up to go in there, and the outside dining area was absolutely chock-a-block. But oh, there's the pie... I'm loving the look of the crust on that actually. Uh, it's a normal pie size. It's in a aluminium tray here and underneath, oh, that is looking like it's cooked perfectly. Oh, yeah. Now, I've got the old fork here. Let's crack it open and check out the mince inside. Mmm. Well, it's it's definitely mincy, isn't it? It's almost slop looking. <laughs> but it's pretty thick. And it's got a nice thick gravy there. It's a solid looking piece of guts inside this pie, that's for sure. Oh, I can't wait to try this. Now this pastry does look light and fluffy and flaky. Mm. It's not seasoned or anything, it's um, kind of a quite bland sort of tasting pastry on top. Nothing extraordinary about it. Let's try some of uh, the guts of this. You can see it's not going anywhere. So it's nice and thick. Holds on well to the fork. Ooh, I spoke too soon. Mmm. Oh, mate. That's got a classic flavour about it. Mmm. Delicious. Oh. Can't wait to dive on in. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Oh. This place underneath is a little bit chewy it's actually gone a little bit soggy but it's really nice and the mince inside is just got this like it's just the perfect seasoning it's not too salty it's but it is has got a nice saltiness about it and the flavor of it is just classic meat pie it's very delicious mmm and you can see how full the pie is there. The meat really does take up the whole depth of this pie. And this pie is probably well, about over an inch thick. Mmm. Wow. Wow, that is salty. It's actually almost too salty. Well, it was in that bite. It is seasoned very well, so 
Is it better to be over-seasoned or under-seasoned? I'll let you decide. Mmm. Wow. Yeah, that is uh, very well seasoned. But just look how much meat is in this. I mean, it's chock-a-block. And I was just looking at this piece here. It's actually like a huge, big, solid piece of mince just there. And if I bite into it, mm, it's almost like a meatball. <laughs> A minced meatball. Maybe it wasn't mixed properly, but still tastes good. I am enjoying this. So I wonder what score I'm going to give it. Out of ten. Well, value-wise, seven bucks for the minced meat pie. Pies don't seem to be that nice, cheap alternative anymore, do they? They sort of have been creeping up in price, and oh, seven bucks nowadays is... Well, I think you can probably still get one for like six, but you know, seven's probably about the average, so. Anyway, is it worth the money? The pastry wasn't awesome. Uh, it was light and fluffy and flaky, though, and really good. I don't know if you need a uh, pastry to be totally awesome, but I think it does help. The flavour inside the mince, well, it's just that classic, perfect meat pie taste. It tasted really great. It was a beautiful blend of everything that you want in a meat pie although it was very salty i found it almost overly salty and uh, well it was still enjoyable though and when it was mixed in with the pastry i mean the pastry was a little bland so it sort of took away the saltiness of the meat it's a super tasty meat pie though is it the best one i've ever had mm, i don't think so but it's still really good so for my all over value, all over flavour, all over taste, all over everything score for the Kiwi Bakehouse mince pie today, I think this one deserves... Mmm. Oh. That's good. A 9.2 out of 10. Mate, this is a really tasty pie. It's just beautiful, it's nice and thick, it's full of mince, a little bit light on weight. The uh, price, you know, they're all about that price nowadays, but flavour-wise, it's a beautiful tasting pie. One of my only complaints is probably it's a little bit too salty, and I, I quite like saltiness, but uh, besides that, mate, it's an awesome pie, and uh, if you're ever around the Narang area, uh, you need to drop into Little Kiwi Bakery. I mean, it's not early. I think it's nearly uh, 2 o'clock in the afternoon here when I'm coming here, and the place is still full, like after lunch. Where the pies were sitting, there was still plenty of pies though, so they must just keep pumping them out all day. So anyway, yeah, the Kiwi Bakehouse, mate. Rip on in and grab a pie, and if you do go, tell them Greg sent you. <laughs> They're not going to have a clue. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. I ate a meat pie. See you then. Ooh, yeah.